What's up guys, welcome to this video. In today's video I want to quickly show you how you can fix the issue in Roblox when you're uh, having low FPS or the game is lagging. That's the topic of today's video, so just stick around if you're interested in that. But before we start right into the topic, I would really like to mention something. You guys would certainly make my day if you could leave a like, comment and subscribe to my small little channel. It would be um, very much appreciated and you would make my day as already mentioned but um, let's start right into the topic how can you fix lag in Roblox on your desktop um, first of all um, I would always suggest you to try uh, quickly restarting your computer and then uh, try launching your Roblox player as administrator so just right click on your desktop shortcut or in a window search and then click on run as administrator um, and then uh, again right click uh, if this didn't work and click on properties and in here uh, change over to the compatibility tab and here I would always suggest you to try running this program in compatibility mode for to check the setting and then Windows 8 is perfectly fine and also down here I would suggest you to tr try uh, disabling the full screen optimizations and um, what also makes sense is to run this program as an, as an administrator every time you launch it um, and then when you're playing Roblox on two or more users this setting here or this button maybe um, is important for you but for the most of you just click on apply and click on OK and then just launch a Roblox player um, and then when it's launched it should be uh, open in, in the background and then just open your task manager so type in, in the window search to task manager and then um, and then uh, just click when it looks something like this click on more details and here um, I would always suggest you to try um, ending tasks that you don't need and that are currently using a lot of capacity so you can also just tr uh, sort f for all of these uh, different components so start by sorting uh, the one with the highest percentage in my case a lot of memory is currently used and then I look at all of these tasks that are uh, demanding so much memory and then um, whenever I found a task that I, that I don't need currently then just select it and click on end task and this you can do with all of the other tasks as well and also with the other components that are also um, highly used so that's the last thing that I would always suggest you. Yes, that's it. Really hope this helped you guys. If you've got any questions left, just leave them in the comment section below. Then I'll write you back as soon as possible and then we will surely find a solution. But that's it. Thank you so much for watching. I wish you a wonderful day. See you in the next video. Bye.